I'm trying not to talk too loud because my neighbors are sleeping, but I had to get this video out for everybody who's been asking me, how do I level up my ultimate weapons and also favorite weapons to level 100? Well, I have reached the end game. That's what I did. I jumped all the way to the end game first, but I got to show you guys the exact process of how to do this. So you guys will be able to understand because a lot of people apparently, I, which I was mind blown, does not know how to do this. So I'm going to go ahead and make this video for you. So let's get into it. Here on Albion, as you guys can see, this is Albion here. You click on it, and here I am over here. This is me, and this is usually where people will spawn. But you can also spawn here. I highly recommend spawning here too if you're trying to research. It's the best way there. But anyways, let's go ahead and break down what do we do when we're trying to upgrade our weapons as fast as possible, especially our ultimate ultimate ones, right? As you guys can see, this here will help you do that. It is called the repair station workbench. You can also do this at Outpost as well, but most people usually are in Albion. So this is exactly where you should do it if you're already here, right? So how do you do it? Well, weapon level transmission. So if, for example, I want to get this rocket launcher all the way up. Oh, first I gotta show you exactly how to favorite stuff. Okay, so once you get to your inventory, and you have your weapons that you want and you find your favorite weapons all you got to do well since i'm on pc um is click register attach item what that does is favorite it and you won't be able to deconstruct it, right so what i need to do is unfavorite something i'm not going to use like for this one right it's a level 100 and i want to get this rocket launcher all the way up to 100 so this is what you should do. And this is works exactly for your ultimate weapons as well. So what you want to do, come over here, weapon level transmission. All right. Then we go to the weapon I want to upgrade all the way to a hundred, click on that and see how it boosts my uh, damage extremely high. And also you need phase exchangers. Now I'm going to give you guys a little secret here right after this. Okay. All right, boom. So now my rocket launcher is level 100. So I'm going to go ahead and I will favorite that. All right, so now it's 100. I can favorite that and I'm gonna unfavorite this one. And then you see how it only registers this one and not that one? That's because I favorited it, right? Or registered it, right? So then when I'm here, here's what I'm gonna tell you. Especially this is all free. I've never bought anything in this game yet due to the fact that I'm trying to see if it's possible to do well, everything for free. Once we get here, here's what here's what I highly recommend you do. OK, get the material you need for this. These phase exchangers, right? I'm not sure why this one's different than this one. It doesn't really make sense to me. But here's what I always like to do every time I'm in Albion, because it's only like a research time of 10 minutes so what i always do every time i come to albion i'll research this one and also uh this one as well yeah you only get one but you need this anyway trust me if you do this as many times as you come to albion it will like skyrocket i have like 10 of these now probably like 12 right and this is for the ultimate weapons right so that is the secret right there, guys. You literally do this every single oh, time you come to child. Albion. What do you need? Make sure these are always like on rotation. Like just keep upgrading these or keep researching these, right? And then once you find your ultimate and your regular weapon that you need, come back all the way over here. And then you will just like example, like I said, okay, here, for example, right here, let's do the ultimate one because I want to show you that it takes that type of material that we were just doing. Uh, let me see which one do I have to upgrade. Oh, I don't have anything right now, but what I want to do is I want to show you anyway. So what I'm going to do is this, and this, but I'm not going to actually upgrade it, right? So I'm going to come here, come to this, 
click on this and then boom click on that and as you guys can see the precision phase exchanger that's what you need and it takes like 10 minutes to upgrade for one so that's why i say continuously upgrade this and then you will get all the maxed weapons you need with your favorite weapons and ultimate weapons doing this method and this is the fastest method that i know of without paying for anything if you guys like this video make sure you hit that subscribe button and catch me in the next one